Tonight, in Nevada County, evacuations have just been lifted as crews work to contain another wildfire. This one near the town of Smartsville. It is now 50% contained, 37 acres destroyed. But earlier tonight, Livecopter 3 was above as those flames engulfed a shed and an RV. Well, the good news out of all this is crews have stopped the fire's forward progress. KJR 3's Mallory Hoff is live in Nevada County near where the fire broke out with some new information tonight. Mallory. Lisa and Golston, a very scary situation for the people who live in this area. I want you to take a good look behind me, though. Tonight, you can still see a number of hot spots continuing to burn. I do want to give you a better indication, though, of how this fire started. It actually started behind this hill and then very quickly made its way up and over, and crews were able to stop it at a road below. This, as people in the area watched and waited. As crews battled a fire, evacuations were ordered along Keller Road in Penn Valley near Smartsville. Evacuations uh, were put in effect along uh, Keller Road, about a, a half dozen homes or so. Uh, that evacuation has been lifted. Video from Livecopter 3 shows an outbuilding and an RV engulfed in flames. I was watching from right up here at this house. The blaze moved quickly, the result of dry conditions and 5 to 10 mile per hour winds. We were all nervous. My mom has a few horses here and some animals, so we were all pretty concerned. Others watched the fire from nearby rooftops. Saw smoke, so he got up on the roof and watched for planes to come. The flames prompted a response from CAL FIRE. Air tankers and helicopters battled the blaze from above. Get nervous right away because you see the smoke. We turned on the hoses right away. You know, just made sure that everything that we could do, we did. And back out here live, I want you to take a good look at this area that seems to have just flared up in the last little while. Again, this area very close to a number of hot spots that crews are still dealing with this evening. Certainly a very uncomfortable situation for people in this area who were waiting throughout the day, waiting to hear how it would all turn out. But tonight, they were all able to go home as that evacuation order 